you to have this. What's that? A pillow? Hand embroidered by my mother. The only thing of hers they let me keep when I went to the circle. Why in the name of Andraste would you give that to me? You've been a good friend, Varric. Uh-uh. You keep your pillow, Blondie. And may you have many more dreams of killing Templars on it. Orc. I didn't expect you here. I want to tell you now. I love you. You've stood by me when I gave you every reason to turn away. Just remember, whatever happens, I wanted you to know that. Why are you talking like this? He'll still be here, you know. Justice. Long after you and I are gone. It doesn't mean the same thing to a spirit. He'll just go back to the Fade. I love you, Anders. You were the most important thing in my life. But some things matter more than my life. More than either of us. I'm sorry. If you were curious, that's not the best way to get me in the mood. I told you I would break your heart. Just know it breaks mine to do it. I was hoping we'd find a better way, but... Justice and vengeance are too intertwined. I can't tell one from the other. You were the one shining light in my life. Never blame yourself for what will happen. I will have the tower searched, top to bottom! You cannot do that! You have no right! I have every right. You are harboring blood mages, and I intend to root them out before they infect this city. Blood magic? Where do you not see blood magic? My people cannot sneeze without you accusing them of corruption. Do not trifle with me, mage. My patience is at an end. A wonder that I never saw it begin. The way you two carry on, people will talk. This does not involve you, champion. I called her here. I think the people deserve to know just what you've done. What I have done is protect the people of this city time and again. What I have done is protect you mages from your curse and your own stupidity. And I will not stop doing it. I will not lower our guard. I dare not. Is there any truth to what she's saying? These are only her latest accusations, nothing more. And what if she does not find what she's looking for? How much further will she go to root out something that isn't there? The Champion knows better than anyone how deep the Circle's corruption goes. I must find the source. Does the word crazy mean anything to you? What other option do we have? Tell me, Champion, that you have not seen with your own eyes what they can do. Heard the lies of mages that seek power. They're not the only ones that lie and seek power. You would cast us all as villains, but it is not so! I know, and it breaks my heart to do it, but we must be vigilant. If you cannot tell me another way, do not brand me a tyrant. This is getting us nowhere. Grand Cleric Athena will put a stop to this. You will not bring her grace into this. The Grand Cleric cannot help you. Explain yourself, mage. I will not stand by and watch you treat all mages like criminals. While those who would lead us bow to their Templar jailers. How dare you speak to the me? The Circle has failed us, Orsino. Even you should be able to see that. The time has come to act. There can be no half measures. Anders, what have you done? There can be no turning back. She listened to me! Blessed be the souls of the faithful that they ascend to your right hand. Why? Why would you do such a thing? I removed the chance of compromise. 
because there is no compromise. The Grand Cleric has been slain by magic. The Chantry destroyed. As Knight Commander of Kirkwall, I hereby invoke the right of annulment. Every mage in the Circle is to be executed. Immediately! The Circle didn't even do this! Champion, you can't let her! Help us stop this madness! And I demand you stand with us! Even you must see that this outrage cannot be tolerated! Why are we debating the right of annulment when the monster who did this is right here? I swear to you, I will kill him. It can't be stopped now. You have to choose. Was that... why you needed me to distract the Grand Cleric? You... were... part of this? If you knew what I was doing, you would have felt honor bound to stop me. I couldn't take that chance. The Circle is an injustice. In many places beyond Kirkwall. The world needs to see. Elthina is not the Circle. She was a good woman, and you murdered her! You fool! You've doomed us all! We were already doomed. A quick death now, or a slow one later. I'd rather die fighting. You're a murderer. The Grand Cleric, the Mages, their blood is on your hands. I know. It doesn't matter. Even if I wished to, I could not stay my hand. The people will demand blood. This won't be easy, but I'll defend you. But what of Anders? Think carefully, champion. Stand with them and you share their fate. I can live with that. Thank the Maker. You are a fool, champion. Kill them all! I will rouse the rest of the Order! Go! Get to the gallows before it's too late! So it's come to this. I don't know if we can win this war, champion, but... Thank you. I will leave your... Friend for you to deal with. I must return to the gallows. Meet me there as soon as you can. There's nothing you can say that I haven't already said to myself. I took a spirit into my soul and changed myself forever to achieve this. This is the justice all mages have awaited. I might have understood if you'd only told me. You condone this. The brutal death of an innocent woman of faith, someone you knew, who trusted you. I wanted to tell you, but what if you stopped me? Or worse, what if you wanted to help? I couldn't let you do that. The world needs to see this. Then we can all stop pretending the circle is a solution. And if I pay for that with my life, then I pay. Perhaps then justice would at least be free. Help me defend the mages. You mean... stay with you? I didn't think you'd let me. But if you do, I'll fight the Templars. Damned right I will. No! You cannot let this abomination walk free. He dies, or I am returning to Starkhaven. And I will bring such an army with me on my return that there'll be nothing left of Kirkwall for these Maleficarum to rule. Do not interfere, Sebastian. I will not fight you, Hawk. My death now would serve nothing. I will return to Starkhaven, but... I swear to you, I will come back and find your precious Anders. I will teach him what true justice is. Thank you for my life. I'll try not to make such a mess of it this time. How invigorating. We'd all best get to the gallows. And quick. It's going to be quite a show.
Quickly! Quickly! First Enchanter! Champion! You've survived! Thank the Maker! We must... And here you are! Let us speak, Meredith! Before this battle destroys the city you claim to protect! I will entertain a surrender. Nothing more. Speak if you have something to say. Revoke the right of annulment, Meredith, before this goes too far. Imprison us if you must. Search the tower. I will even help you. But do not kill us all for an act we did not commit. The Grand Cleric is dead, killed by a mage. The people will demand retribution, and I will give it to them. Your offer is commendable, Orsino, but it comes too late. We can still prevent this, before you both tear Kirkwall apart. You heard her. She's wanted this all along. You realize this is a cause you cannot hope to win. Sorry, Fenris. Some causes are worth fighting for. I agree. I suppose I should have expected no less from you, champion. So be it. You will share the Circle's fate. So what is it to be, Meredith? Do we fight here? Go. Prepare your people. The rest of the Order is already crossing the harbor. This isn't over. My fellow mages, heed me. The Templars will come. For all our power, we cannot defeat such an army. There is only one option for us all. Survive. Do not submit. Do not fall on your knees before them. Get out of Kirkwall. Spread word to the other circles. They will not get away with this. Prepare your people, champion, and then speak with me. If we have any chance of surviving, it will be with your help. Nervous Hawk? My mother didn't raise any stupid children. I know how dangerous this fight will be. Well, that's comforting. It's the most dangerous thing we could ever do, but at least we know that. You know me, Hawk. I'm not one for long goodbyes. I'm not sure we should be doing this. Helping dangerous people run amok. But I'm with you. We face down worse things than this, Varric. What could possibly go wrong? Oh, I hate it when you say that. What do you say we put an end to all this waiting around and go meet destiny? I feel like I'm forgetting something. Or there's more to do, or... Does all this feel like a dream to you, too? I can't believe it's come to this. You'll get us through this. You always do. Hawk, before we go, I... Meryl, whatever happens, I'm proud to have known you. Shouldn't you be halfway to Tevinter by now? Maker's breath. Take off with a priceless relic once and you never hear the end of it. Your life would have been easier if you had just cut me out of it. But you stood by me. You defied the Canari. And fought their Arashok for me, even after I betrayed you. If you'd gone with them, I wouldn't have been able to yell at you. Oh. Well, I'm glad you wanted to yell at me so badly then. I know I don't exactly inspire confidence. But I swear, I'm going to come through for you this time. When you look for me, I'll be fighting at your side. Captain. Ah, uh, not for much longer if this goes bad. What a mess. You really put loyalty to the test, you know. Donick has kept the guard protecting civilians. Meredith will have no support from them. With luck, well, let's just say we need some luck. 
I have Aveline, the captain of the guard. I'm not worried. Somehow I think our troubles are just starting. I hope you're right about all of this. History doesn't care about good intentions. I'm ready. Say the word. I should have trusted you. Even with all we've shared, I never thought you'd spare my life. If we live through this, you know I'll be hunted. No one in Kirkwall will offer me mercy. But if you would join me, I'd rather be on the run with you than safe with anyone else. Then we will be fugitives together. We will fight for a world where our children can be born mages and free. Ten years, a hundred years from now, someone like me will love someone like you. And there will be no Templars to tear them apart. May the Maker bring us victory, or everything else is meaningless. Meryl, attack from a distance. Stay out of the fight as much as you can. I will. Aveline, charge in whenever you see an opening. Very well. So, this is it. Some of you are worried. Maybe I am too. Break it down! But I'm not staying long enough to find out. Here I come. What I know is that I don't like being cornered. And I can fight harder scared than they can angry. We're getting out. And I'm buying when we do. Look at it all. Why don't they just drown us as infants? Why wait? Why give us the illusion of hope? I refuse to keep running. I won't wait for her to kill me. Meredith will die long before you do. If only I could believe that. Quentin's research was too evil, too dangerous, so I put it aside. But I see now there is no other way. Meredith expects blood magic? Then I will give it to her. Make her help us all.
desperation. We best get moving. We're not in the clear yet. And here we are, champion. At long last. I imagine you've wanted to be rid of me for some time. I bear you no ill will. You've done this to yourself. You are no mage. But in supporting them, you've elected to share their fate. Knight Commander, I thought we intended to arrest the Champion. You will do as I command, Cullen. No. I defended you when Thrask started whispering you were mad. But this is too far. I will not allow insubordination. We must stay true to our path. Andraste's dimpled butt cheeks. You recognize it, do you not? Your lyrium, taken from the deep roads. The dwarf charged a great deal for his prize. It seems a lot more sword-like than I remember. All of you! I want her dead! Enough! This is not what the Order stands for. Knight Commander, step down. I relieve you of your command. My own knight captain falls prey to the influence of blood magic. You all have. You're all weak. Allowing the mages to control your minds. To turn you against me. But I don't need any of you. I will protect this city myself. You'll have to go through me. Idiot boy. Just like all the others. She's lost it. Just like Bartrand. Blessed are those who stand before the corrupt and the wicked, and do not falter! name became a rallying cry, a reminder that the mighty Templars could be defied. She had defended the mages against a brutal injustice, and many lived to tell the tale. The circles rose up and set the world on fire. More Templars arrived at Kirkwall to restore order, but we were already long gone. We vanished into the hills, and circumstance eventually forced us all to leave the champion's side. Well, all of us except for Anders. You still hear the stories, of course. With each telling they grow, even if at the core remains the truth. A new legend had been born. So that's it. That's the whole story. Then Meredith provoked the circle. She was to blame. Or that damned idol was. Or Anders. Take your pick. Even so, had the champion not been there... 
It might never have even gone that far. I see. So how is hearing all this going to help? You've already lost all the circles. In fact, haven't the Templars rebelled as well? I thought you decided to abandon the Chantry to hunt the mages. Not all of us desire war, Varric. Please, if you know where the champion is, you must tell me. She is a hero. A woman that the mages would listen to. Someone who was there at the beginning. The champion could stop this madness before it's too late. She may be the only one who can. Is that what this is all about? In that case, I wish I could help you. Just tell me one thing, then. Is the champion dead? Though, I doubt that. Then you are free to go, Varric. May the Maker watch over you during the dark times ahead of us. Same to you, Seeker. Same to you. So, did you... Gone. Just like the Warden. That is no coincidence. So, do we proceed with the original plan? Or keep looking? It is in the Maker's hands now. We put our faith in him. I'm not calling you. 